Chevrolet FNR concept. The Chevrolet FNR XE is the Bowtie's first all-electric sedan concept, and it previews the brand's future all-electric offerings. The concept is for a vehicle with small to medium proportions. The Chevy FNR XE concept car has a sleek, muscular design that slopes into a fastback-style rear end. The design reduces wind resistance and increases electric efficiency. The model's aggressive stance and low front end are evocative of American muscle cars, particularly the Chevy Camaro's external design proportions. The idea even has a dynamic race car-inspired front splitter, bold, streamlined style lines, and a greenhouse trim coated in black and silver. Atlas ATV Atlas ATV is a Ukrainian-made off-road vehicle that can go on land and water. If this vehicle appears familiar, it's probably because it's built on the same chassis as the Sherp ATV. Unlike the Sherp ATV, the Atlas ATV is longer, has a larger cabin, and includes several additional amenities. Atlas ATV weighs 4,850 pounds and has a maximum load capacity of more than 3,300 pounds. The Atlas can easily transport 12 persons, but don't expect it to be a speed demon. The all-terrain vehicle has a maximum speed of 37 miles per hour on land and 4.3 miles per hour on water. It also features all-wheel drive, with the four huge wheels acting as propellers in the water. Atlas asserts that anybody with a driver's license can drive their vehicles. KRECHETZ 210. The Cresce has a suggested maximum speed of 50 km per hour to tackle any barrier. It can easily move in loose snow. It is powered by a 2.5 litre Hyundai engine that produces 100 horsepower. It comes with differential locking, reduction gear, an automated tire inflation system, and a winch. The wheels have enough buoyancy to navigate water barriers. The Cresce has a ground clearance of 600 mm and entry exit angles of 52 degrees. Techno Impulse Cresce effortlessly climbs 45 hills. The driver's seat is located in the center of the cabin. The inside is really comfy, and it is intended to be used for sleeping. Toyota Tundra Crewmax. Toyota's Tundra Crewmax full-size pickup truck features a large interior, powerful engine, and robust bed. Starting at $40,000, the 2024 model has a twin-turbo V6 engine. Upgrade to a hybrid powertrain to get 437 horsepower and 583 lbft of torque. This device is both powerful and safe, including a 14-inch touchscreen and different trim choices. The 2023 model, priced at $38,900, is comparable to the present model in design and performance. The 2021 and 2019 models have older engines and fewer advanced technologies, making them more affordable in the used market. Ripsaw EV3 F4. The tank features polyurethane tracks and 51 centimeters of ground clearance, making it suitable for all terrains. Despite its tough exterior, the inside features two comfy Recaro front seats that are heated and ventilated. Inside, you'll see a steering wheel that looks similar to the yoke found in the Tesla Model S Plaid. The Ripsaw includes two 12-inch touchscreen screens from Garmin. In addition to the standard panel that displays driving information, there is additional screen that shows the external cameras. The Ripsaw can also be utilized at night because to its several cameras, which provide drivers with a 360-degree vision, thermal views, and even infrared. The Ripsaw's name implies that it has an electric drivetrain, which is not the case. The engine is a 6.6-litre turbo diesel Duramax V8, which produces 800 horsepower and 1,500 pound-feet of torque. UDX Airwolf the Airwolf is a two-seat EVTOL hoverbike aircraft powered by electric ducted fans. Our uniqueness solves the drone issue statement. Vertical takeoff, landing, as well as flight, have energy needs. All present drone solutions, even with improved batteries, are energetically ineffective. Wings substantially improve energy efficiency. With the highest effective flying speed of 120 km per hour, energy is used 20% more than during takeoff. Tilting motors have the capacity to direct the flow of air, which increases control accuracy while simultaneously reducing energy needs for forward flight. Bio-hybrid. In recent years, no other vehicle category has experienced the same level of growth as the e-bike. 
The bio-hybrid duo is a novel vehicle concept that takes the notion of an electric bike to the next level. Customers who choose the limited Pioneer Edition, available at the first buying stage, can save money while still enjoying the complete bio-hybrid luxury driving experience. The Pedelec includes a portable battery and charger, as well as features such as a 5-inch multi-touch display, 4G and GPS integration, LED lighting, a panoramic roof, a USB charge port, navigation with topology-based range projection, turn signals, full suspension, hydraulic disc brakes and more. Geo Rescue ATV The Geo Rescue is a powerful 4x4 off-road rescue vehicle capable of navigating challenging terrains and giving critical aid in times of need. During times of need, it might serve as a beacon of hope rather than a deity to worship. This vehicle is essential for providing firefighting and medical solutions in distant and tough regions, where traditional rescue vehicles are hesitant to go. The Geo's sturdy design allows for many modification choices. This adaptability makes it suitable for various weather situations across the world. The Geo Rescue Vehicle combines strength and beauty, making it a popular option among off-road aficionados. Widescape WS250 Widescape is a new power sports business from Canada. This Monday, it introduced its first winter ATV, the WS250 Upright Snowmobile. We're told it's lightweight, agile, somewhat quiet, and suited for off-road excursions. The modified snowmobile from Widescape sounds a lot like a 250cc motorbike in terms of weight, proportions, and power. It weighs just under 200 pounds, and the handlebars are little more than 4 feet off the deck. It's thin enough that two people can fit comfortably within most truck beds, and it's short enough to fit on the back hitch rack of most SUVs. The WS250 doesn't have the power of a Timbersalt, but its four-stroke EFI, direct-drive CVT gearbox, and luggy 38mm rubber should be enough to disrupt some pure backcountry snow. Mud Ox Vengeance the Mudo X Vengeance is an amphibious vehicle capable of handling many terrains, including mud, snow, ice, and water. The sturdy chassis can hold a variety of attachments, and the skid steer T20 gearbox allows for precise turning. The engine options range from 31 to 40 horsepower, and it can accommodate up to six passengers. The standard price covers numerous purposes, including hunting, farming, land management, recreation, and light industrial duties. This equipment is powerful and dependable, capable of overcoming any barrier. The Mudo X Vengeance is designed for both work and pleasure, providing strength and dependability. Ravani Hercules 6X6 ATV Although Hercules draws attention for its FCA-sourced engine choices, the top V8 option is amazing. This engine, which allows the car to produce 1,320 horsepower, features a massive supercharger. However, to acquire this engine option, you must pay more than the vehicle's starting price of $225,000. Ravani incorporates Napa leather and suede accents throughout the cabin. Users that upgrade to Hercules 6x6 Military Edition will find a FLIR night vision system, a lockable gas tank, electronic door handles, sirens, and gas masks included. We should also mention that certain variants of the vehicle are armored to guard against rocket assaults. Bugatti Bolide. Bugatti Bolide, which entered our lives as a notion, has been in our minds ever since. This unique vehicle, which the brand came into production in a short period of time, is not one of the typical French vehicles. So few individuals have been able to purchase this model. The variant, in which we can hear the engine sound for the first time, really roars with its 8.0-litre quad-turbo W16 engine. Bugatti has gone above and beyond to create this sound uniquely Bolide. Bolide has a distinct exhaust timbre from the Chiron on which it is built. With a total power output of 1,580 horsepower and 1,600 newton meters of torque, this insane unit keeps Bolide's weight power ratio at 0.9 kilograms per horsepower. AirDrive AirDrive is a study on an inflatable amphibious vehicle built of double walled cloth. The Slovenians from Hovercraft created AirDrive, an inflatable and foldable amphibious vehicle constructed of DWF, and displayed it at Metz in Amsterdam. Foldable and lightweight, it is ideal for Nautica, Special Forces, Rescue, and Recreational Activities. Capable of navigating, the four huge wheels include an integrated electric motor that can be controlled remotely via remote control. Alpine Alpen Glow 
Alpen street vehicles may not be recognized for their extravagant style, but this Alpenglo idea would draw attention even when parked beside a Delage D12, an Aston Martin Valkyrie, and a Bugatti Bolide. Furthermore, it is loud. Furthermore, it produces no emissions. It comes after another, similarly striking hydrogen hypercar design, the A4810, which Alpine showed in March 2022 and which our own CC Vice characterized as looking like an intergalactic fighter jet. It's no small effort, but the Alpenglo manages to make the A4810 appear more traditional and logical in contrast. This low-slung bullet of a thing is less than a meter tall and has the proportions of a futuristic Le Mans racer. Its lines are so slick that you'd expect it to be nearly as quick underwater as on land, complete with a single-seat jet fighter cabin, a gigantic double-wing structure in the back, and a set of jagged-looking LED taillights that stretch considerably further back than the tail fins on a A57T bird. Camars 2031. The Camus 231 is a future car that can turn 360 degrees and park automatically. The trailer sits on top of two carts located at the front and back of the unit. Camus 2031 is not yet a commercial product, hence its pricing is unknown. The Russian company offers affordable and high-quality Camus trucks across many variants. A Camus 6520 dump truck costs around $40,000 on the market. Tracker 800SX. The Tracker 800SX side-by-side -side ATV offers outstanding value. This model is stronger and has standard features such as electronic power steering, a tilting bed capable of lifting 1,000 pounds, and a robust and comfortable cabin. The engine is a strong 50 horsepower 82 cubic cm three-cylinder unit. Additional features include a full-length skid plate, 58 dB idle disc brakes on each corner, and a towing capability of one ton. 